Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back and thanks for taking a little time to tune into the video, much appreciated. And today I'm gonna to give you guys the, uh, mainly the main key baits that I like to throw in the month of January. Um, you know, when the water temperature's cold, really from about from now to the first part of February, I've got a handful of baits that really produce well for me under a variety of conditions. And today we're here at the Baitworks Tackle Store here in, you can see it here, the Baitworks Tackle Store here in Springfield, Missouri. Um, show you guys what I like to use in January. If you guys are ordering any, or interested in ordering any of this stuff that I'm gonna show you guys, I'll include the Baitworks link in the description. You can order it through there or swing by the tackle store if you ever get to Springfield, Missouri. So here we go, I'll show you what I like to use this time of year. First of all, let's look at one of the favorite uh, deep water lures I like to use. And this is the Mega Bass Diner Response. This is a blade bait. Uh, the blade baits have been around forever, but you've never seen one that really has this attention to detail as far as the colors go on it. And I like to fish this both pumping it off the bottom, fishing it vertical, uh, making long casts in deep water. So that's definitely one. Um, here's the meat and butter though that we're gonna talk about, my favorites. All the different uh, Mega Bass jerk baits here. X80 is one of my favorite. Uh, this is one of my favorite jerk baits, guys. <clears throat> if you have real tough fishing conditions, like if you got bright sunny skies, not much wind, really clear water, <clears throat> a little bit downsized, X80 will definitely produce more fish. But if there's one bait that I was gonna say my favorite for the month of January, it's the Mega Bass 110 plus one. And you can see the lip on the thing there. It's got a deeper lip and this will allow the bait to get down, you know, into that 10 to 12 foot range with eight pound test line. A lot of different good colors here. This is just one of my absolute favorite baits during the month of January. Also the plus two model. If the fish are super deep, you can see how much bigger the lip is on the plus two. On a light line, a long cast, that bait will get down to like 15 feet deep. Um, the 110 also, the, you know, the, just the straight 110, I uh, use it quite a bit in January if the water's a little bit more off colored and the fish are shallow. So this particular model, I'm using a lot if that water visibility is like under three feet. Here's another one of my favorites right here, guys, is the 110 plus one junior. Um, this is a fairly new bait. It's um, probably a quarter or so, a quarter or so less size than the 110 plus one regular model. This is an excellent bait during the winter time. Again, if the fish are a little bit more finicky on the bright days uh, when you don't have much wind, but you cannot beat a jerk bait for the month of January. Now, another thing I really like to use is a some type of a small swim bait. So here's the Mega Bass Hazendong Shad three inch right here. Um, I'll pair this up with the uh, Mega Bass Okashira Jig Head. Um, or the Okashira screw head with the spinner on it, depending upon the water clarity. But um, anyway, this little three inch swim bait setup with the jig head, um, fishing it over deep main lake points uh, if the fish are suspended in particular. Now, getting away from the Mega Bass a little bit, another one of my favorite is the uh, Rapala Ice Jig. Um, this is a, a staple in the Ozark Lakes here. Basically, it's a bait for suspended fish. Uh, these are one of the top lures down here, anytime you're on some type of a spoon bite where you're seeing those fish uh, visible on your electronics, um, the ice jig is sort of like a, a local favorite around this part of the country. So um, it's that's a pretty much the uh, overview of it, jerk baits, deep water baits, and uh, you know, the diner response. So anyway, guys, just wanted to give you guys a quick little uh, preview of what I'm throwing in January here. Um, January, like I said, you don't have as many options as you do in different times of year as far as catching fish in a variety of different water depths. Um, most of the time, in the winter time, your fish are gonna be suspended, they're gonna be a little bit deeper, and that narrows your selection down. Um, I'll fish some finesse jigs a little bit, some too, but for the most part, you know, I'm fishing a jerk bait or some type of a uh, jig and spoon, you know, the Dyna Response, a Rapala Ice Jig, that type of stuff. Um, you know, Alabama rig is good in the winter time too. I just don't like to fish the thing. For me, it's some type of jerk bait. Um, and the main consideration for me uh, in jerk bait fishing in January is the size of the bait they want and the depth that they want it. So I've got to determine the size of the uh, bait is going to be the best, how deep they want it, the color of it, and that type of stuff. So anyway, guys, just here at Baitworks today, if you guys are interested in any any fishing tackle at all, not just mega bass, man. Just uh, check out the bait works uh, online. I'll, I'll include the link in the description here. Great way to support the channel, and uh, we'll talk to y'all later. See you.